Hey guys, welcome back to another Premiere Pro CC tutorial. I'm your host, Gilly Gill. Today we're gonna talk about importing files. We've gone over how uh, the program is laid out, where all the workspaces and the panels are. Now we're gonna start actually bringing footage into the program. So right where we left off, we have a program open and it's just a blank canvas. We don't really have anything going on here. We need to bring in some footage. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the project panel and you can import footage a couple of ways. You can right in the middle here where it says import media to start, you could right click that and go import or you could go up above to file, import or you can see the, the keyboard shortcut right here, control I. So let's do that because I'm a big fan of keyboard shortcuts. Keyboard shortcuts for the win. Commander Control I brings up the import dialog box and we're just gonna select a couple of these random clips and you know if you just select one it's gonna select a single one or you can hold control or command and click on each one you want. Let's say we'll just bring those six in and then click open. And just like that we've brought in footage to the project panel so that we can start looking at those clips in the source monitor. So in order to get these clips to show up in the source monitor, all you have to do is double click on the clip that you want to preview from the project panel. And boom, it pops right up in the source monitor and now we have this little playhead. You can see the little blue guy here is the playhead. You can drag and, and kind of scrub this footage and see what part of this clip is important to your video. So there is one other way to bring in files and it's kind of one of my favorite. I'm a drag and drop kind of guy. It kind of simplifies things a bit and it's especially useful if you have two monitors. So let's say you have your uh, finder window or your files window open and you have the folder open with all of your clips. So we're just gonna drag a clip. Let's say we just want this one clip. Just click and drag it and drop it right into the project panel and voila there it is now keep in mind and this will be something useful for the next video the information that you can see about these clips is shown all right beside the file name so if you scroll over you can see that this particular clip was filmed at 59.94 frames per second it starts at zero and ends at 33.29 there's no specified video in or out points, so that's the entire thing, 33.30 .30 seconds. This panel will show you all sorts of information about your footage. Now that information is gonna become useful to you when you go to start creating your sequence, which we'll go over in the next video. That's pretty much it, guys. We've imported footage into our project, and now it's time for us to create a sequence and start compiling our timeline. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you in the next one.